Hi guys, so today I am going to be unboxing Dean's 130 Mood Trouble. This is his first mini album, his first EP, his only EP um, currently out. But um, this is one that came out a while ago, I think back in 2016, and I've been wanting it for such a long time. But um, kept putting it off, and eventually I was just like, nope, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna get this because I love this album. I still listen to it consistently. I still listen to it all the time, um, and it's one of my favorite albums to listen to when I'm trying to like calm down from a long day. So yeah, let's get into this unboxing. It's probably going to be pretty quick because um, yeah, it doesn't look like there's that much in there. Like, everyone already has this album. I really like Dean's stuff, though, and he has such a beautiful voice. It's like this, and then the CD comes out here, I believe. So here is the CD. It just, it comes in like this, um, pouch slot here. So, there is, um, like, Polaroids in this pouch. And I'll go through the track listing as well while I go through these. So first up we have, um, Ote or Outro. And then we have uh, Put Up or Pour Up. Then Bonnie and Clyde. What to do. Um, D or Half Moon. D, Half Moon. Then I love it. And 21. And yeah, that is it. That's this is the credits for this album. So yeah, that's cute all the Polaroids with the um like artsy <laughs> pictures on here. Very aesthetic. Um so my favorite song my favorite song on here is 21 i think it's 21 but i do love this album a lot i listen to it like i said i listen to this a lot um i just find it very chill and easy to listen to on repeat and it's just a really great album to listen to when you're trying to unwind and yeah i just really really love this album i really hope that dean will put out another ep or better yet a full length because I know he's done some singles in the meantime, like Instagram and like Dayfly, but um, I really want like a full length or just more tracks from him because I think he's beautiful. And I also, I, his voice is beautiful. Um, he's beautiful too, of course. Um, but I also think that he, um, I really like his tracks that he's written for other artists as well. Um, and I recently just found out that he wrote like Unique's EO EO, which is like one of like the best bops ever. And I had no idea that he wrote and produced that, but he did. Um, and I don't know, just make, that somehow makes me love him even more. And yeah, um, that's pretty much it. Thank you so much for watching.